know. I know. <sighs> Y'all so extra. Shut up. Getting on my nerves. Irritating. Yes, I know. It was dumb. But I have it. And it's unique. I hit hard bars. You can't tell me nothing. Spit fire burning shit like a fucking toaster. Your main bitch want to pull me closer. Is this something? Oh my god. Alright. What's good, Mooma? Who is Mooma? I feel like I look like a mushroom right now. What's good, Mo Mafia? It's your girl Mo. And y'all, today, I'm on the famous couch. I'm on the famous couch because I'm just sitting here. I don't know what the hell I said that for. I'm slow. Anyways, let's get into the video. Today, I'm going to be showing y'all. I mean, I know y'all seen my tats a million times. But I'm going to be... um. You know, telling y'all about the ones that really mean something and a few that I could have done without, okay? Make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, turn on post notifications, hit that bell so y'all know when I'm dropping bangers. Y'all, I leave to go home this week in a couple days. Um, for anybody who's looking to support me while I go home, I'm going to leave my cash app. Y'all know this trip was expensive for me. YouTube is my only stream of income right now, so any little bit helps. All right, I love y'all, my mafia, and I appreciate everybody who has already been helping me out. Y'all want honey? My nigga. <laughs> so okay, so first to get off into this tat, I'ma show y'all my first tattoo, the first tattoo that I ever got. Okay, and that would be this one right here, the one that say Momo spelt wrong. Yes, they spelt it wrong. Let me tell y'all a little story behind this tattoo, right? Yep. Yeah. So, my oldest sister had a tattoo party, and I was 16. I'll never forget it. And I was like, man, I want a tattoo so bad. Like, my mom was there. My sisters was there. They was drinking. We was turning up. They was lit. Now, I'm 16. You feel me? And I'm just like, I want a tattoo. Like, what? I was like, either I'm going to get one now, and y'all going to know about it, or I'm going to get one later, and y'all won't know. And I'm going to come home with it, and then what? What? You going to whoop me? I'm too big for whoopings. So they let me get it because I'm spoiled. And I got it. And at the time, this is how I spelt Momo. I didn't know I wanted to put an E on Mo. But now I do know that. So please don't spell my name like this. All right, y'all. Second tattoo. Let me think. What was my second tattoo? Oh. I'm steady glazing. Now don't look, don't look at my jiggly arms. I don't, I don't like my arms, y'all. I'm steady glazing. Now I'm gonna tell y'all the meaning behind that. But first, I gotta change the camera battery because, as y'all know, it's going dead. All right, y'all, we back. So second tattoo was I'm steady glazing. Yes, that's a donut bitten off of with glaze dripping off of it. Now, let me tell y'all the story behind that one. <sighs> Growing up, I, I had a, I had brothers and family, cousins, they rapped. And they was, gla they was glazing. Well, it really started with this dude that was my brother's friend. He, like, started glazing ENT. Because, like, you know, when you when you stunting on somebody, you glazing. You lit. You gla glaze right. They had a song. Glaze right, glaze left, no, glaze left, glaze right, we getting money all night, we stunting and y'all hype, keep jacking, I just might white choke ya, you feel me, it was lit, okay, so, they had started that up, and like, you know, with me being like a tomboy and stuff at the time, I just wanted to fit in and be part of the glazing airs, you feel me, so I got that. On my little jiggly arms or whatever. So, yeah. Got that tattoo. And then, um, what was next? I want to say, after I got that, I was like, okay, I'm going to start going crazy. And that's when I got the Wisconsin. Can y'all see that? That's when I got the Wisconsin. Shape of the Wisconsin with all the um, stuff in it. I got the Green Bay 
the Brewers and then the Wisconsin Badger. I, I added that as a little touch because my I have a brother. My oldest brother actually used to play for the Badgers, y'all. Um, if y'all can look him up, if y'all want, his name is Booker Stanley. He was cold. You feel me? Now he does like production. He has models. He does. He's a video videographer. He cold. He he beastie. Look him up, Booker Stanley. Um, yeah, that's that. And then from there, I think I just started doing dumb stuff. So, this is the part that comes to the tattoo that I'm really ashamed of. Don't judge me. I was young and dumb. Actually, after that, I got this. Truly blessed with this. Some guy fresh out of jail, Mexican dude, did this. He did a good job, though. It's not that bad. You feel me? People just make fun of me because I don't have a neck and it's a permanent necklace on my chest. But it is what it is. I ain't tripping. Um, oh, after that, I'm lying. After this... I, I was finna go all off track. After that, I got the stars in my ear. Can y'all see? Is this the right ear? Yeah. So I got stars in my ear after that. And I got hearts behind my ear on both sides and on my pulse points on my hand. I was supposed to get them right here too. But I was just like, maybe that's doing too much. So after that tattoo... I didn't think. Um, I got established 11790. That's my birthday. After that, what did I get? My ex girlfriend's name. Her name is Ashley. At the at the time, we was like best friends though. It wasn't even like that. Like we was in between going together and being friends. She, I actually recently, about a month ago, found out she got my name covered up, and she has a boyfriend now. So yeah, I gotta get hers covered up. That's petty as hell, but I'm doing it. Call it what you want. Um, let me see. Uh, after that, I got me and my mama name on my wrist. This one says, "Why is my wrist crooked?" Well, this one says my mama name Ramona, and this one says my name Mona Lisa. And then that's when I got dumb. Okay, so at this time, I'm probably 16, 17, 18, 19, probably about 19, 20, and my tat game is getting strong, and uh, I decided to start a gay sleeve. Here it says woman eater, okay, it gets worse. Right here it says kisses to my missus. This is supposed to represent my mom, my grandma, and whatever woman I marry. That's what I told myself at the time. Neither here nor there. Don't judge me. I'm sharing my shit with y'all. So relax. Um, then I got MB. Mona Lisa Benson. Right. And then I got the gay symbol. Two girls being gay symbol. <sighs> now this is very hard for me. To, 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 to tell people about. So please do not. In the comments, go crazy on me, y'all, for real, because I'm insecure about this tattoo. All right, I'm gonna stand up and show y'all so y'all can get a good look at it because I know y'all petty. All right, it's cat paws with the rainbow filled in. Oh, shit, just put lotion on. What the hell? But it's cat paws with the rainbow filled in. And then it says, follow, duh, just like Mo Duggoat, follow, duh, pussy. Oh, I know. I know. <sighs> Y'all so extra. Shut up. Getting on my nerves. Irritating. Yes, I know. It was dumb. But I have it. And it's unique. I don't know what made me do that. But I did it. All right. So then my sisters start having kids and I went crazy with a niece and nephew sleeve. Got Layla, Demarie, Alina, Jamil, Chance, Amira, um, Allende, Nevea, all, all my nieces and nephews. I have to add Nyla, Baby Book. Because they just keep having kids. I don't, I'm going to run out of room um, at this point. 
And then I tried to tattoo myself right here, y'all. Let me show y'all. And it, in the course, it says glaze. That that was back when I start had the glazing air stuff going on in my brain. All right, y'all. That's pretty much all the tattoos that matter or that are stupid. Um. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I got God's gift. Is that what that say? No, God's trap treaser. God's treaser. Yes, he spelt it wrong. It says God. Y'all, I told you I got a couple that I'm ashamed of. It says God's treasure. T R E S. What do that even say? Is that a U R E? Y'all, don't judge me, okay? I I'm human just like you. Don't be that way. And then I got Milwaukee with the city on the back. Say Hamp right there. That's where I was where I was raised. Hamp Squad type stuff. All right. So y'all, that's pretty much it. Oh, on my on the back of this arm, I got Logan. Uh, Logan's name. I have yet to get Ava name. I need to like. But I just chilled on tattoos for a while. Y'all, all in all, I have about forty four tattoos. Um. Oh, I got a tat best friend tattoo on my leg. It say a best friend is a sister that destiny forgot to give you. And me and my best friend both have that. That's the only tattoo that I cried on. I have never, like y'all, I was lit when I got all of these. Like, I'm a drinker. I'm not no alcoholic or nothing. But, you know, I, I get lit. I drunk. And they say you're not supposed to drink when you get tatted, but it didn't make me bleed a lot at all. Maybe because I'm thicker, you know? But the tattoo on my leg, I cried like a baby. Like, literally tears. Like, I was crying. I will never get my leg. Like, that's the only leg tattoo I have. I will never get any other leg tattoos because of that one. Like, dead eye. Alright? So, shout out to... Uh, my subscribers that wanted me to do this video. I appreciate you for the idea. I think I pretty much did good. I don't know what else to say. Um, I'm trying to remember if I have any tattoos that I didn't tell y'all about. Oh, I have um, misunderstood on my back too. It's some stuff on my back that I, I, I forgot I had. Oh yeah, and I got a cross on my back. And does that one say God's gift? Let's turn around and look. Maybe y'all can see it. Let's see. Can y'all see them? Oh, yeah. I got that one. And then where is the misunderstood tattoo? There you go. Misunderstood right there. Bam. So, yep. That's all my tattoos, y'all. Make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, turn on post notifications, hit that bell so y'all know when I'm dropping bangers. I'm going home to visit my family. I got a lot of bangers coming for y'all. I got some collabs with some pretty dope youtubers that's in milwaukee you know what i'm saying help them out a little bit get it in with them right quick you know what i'm saying i'm all for helping my peoples out you feel me i just want everybody to win so i'm gonna do some collabs back home do some videos with my family my nieces and nephews want to do a video everybody want to do a video it's crazy y'all but i'm gonna be there for a while so i should have time i'm pretty got, much got a schedule of what i'm gonna do all right I love y'all, my mafia. I appreciate y'all. Shout out to everybody, all 300 of y'all that was on my live uh, yesterday, well, Sunday night. Y'all really helped me get through some anxiety I was having. I just want y'all to know that, okay? And my mafia, we finna get lit because we the shit. Gang. <laughs>